Hi, welcome. My name is Heath, product specialist for Alesis, and I'm here to show you Master Control. You've got eight touch-sensitive, 100 millimeter motorized Alps faders, plus a dedicated master fader. Each of the eight touch-sensitive faders allow you to select a track by simply touching the fader. This will give you a total control of your mix. You can move quickly from one group of eight tracks to the next by using the bank buttons. Or move one track at a time by using the track button. Above each fader, there are four buttons dedicated to common functions in your DAW software. Track Select, Record Enable, Solo, and Mute. Master Control has eight 360 degree knobs. Each knob can handle three functions, which are determined by the presets you're using. With Cubase, for example, the first knob can control pan, send one on or off, and send one level. To get from one function to another, simply push the corresponding row select button to the left of the knobs. You can clearly see each available function by using the included template overlay that corresponds to your preset. There are a dozen presets in the unit allowing you to control virtually every existing DAW system, including Cubase, Ableton Live, Pro Tools, Logic, Digital Performer, Sonar, and a bunch of others. There are also presets for controlling plugins. In addition to the 360 degree knobs, Master Control has eight assignable buttons, each of which can handle two functions thanks to the buttons A and B switch. Things like punching in, setting and jumping to markers, and setting global read and write automation states can each be set with a single button push. Master Control's display gives you a feedback at a glance about what you're doing. Touch a fader, turn a knob, or touch a button, and the display will give you an instant readout of what you're doing. Okay, let's have a look at the control room monitor and transport section of Master Control. These three buttons let you enable or disable each of the three analog output pairs. The one and two output level control acts as your master volume control. It can be set to control the output level of outputs one and two, outputs one through four, or all six analog outs. This means that master control six analog outputs can be easily used as three sets of stereo outs to feed multiple pairs of monitors, a single 5.1 surround output with ganged volume control, or a combination of monitor outs with volume control and other outputs for effect sends, submic outs, etc. Here are your headphone output level knobs. You can select one of the three output pairs for each headphone output, giving you the ability to set up two completely separate headphone cue mixes with dedicated volume control for each. You've got the transport controls you'd expect. Rewind, fast forward, stop, play, and record, along with a professional jog wheel that'll let you quickly move forward and backward with a session timeline with pinpoint precision. Depending on your DAW software, you can even use the jog wheel to scrub your audio. There are also four cursor keys that'll let you quickly select tracks or zoom in and out horizontally and vertically. Master Control lets you communicate with your musicians thanks to an onboard talkback mic, which can be activated with the front panel button or with a foot switch. As you can see, making music with Master Control is extremely easy. And since it comes with both Cubase LE and Ableton Live Lite, Master Control truly is everything you need to make music with your computer. Find out more at alesis.com or visit your favorite Alesis dealer to put your hands on Master Control today.